In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to move files on your Chromebook. If you have files in the Files app of your Chromebook, you'll often want to move those files around. You might want to move a file into a different folder, or out of a folder, or maybe onto Google Drive, or onto a flash drive, or external hard drive, or something like that. But no matter where you want to move a file to, all you really need to do is drag and drop it wherever you want to move it to. So, for example, let's say we've got this file here, this picture that says coolguy.jpg, and we want to move it into this folder here. All you need to do is click and hold down on it like that, and then start to drag your mouse while you're still holding the click button and drag it all the way until it's hovering over the folder you want to move it to, and then just let go of the click button. So we'll drag it up like that and let go. And now, as you can see, the file has disappeared from here and it's been moved into the folder. And if you don't have a proper mouse like Timmy does, if you're just using the trackpad on your Chromebook, that's fine, it's basically the same thing. You'll just click and hold on the file by clicking one of your fingers in the bottom right hand corner of the trackpad like that. And then you can use any of your other fingers, but probably a finger from this hand, the other hand, to drag the file along like that. So now you can use the finger from your right hand or whatever your finger you're using for that to drag the file around and then you can just hover it over the folder and let go. And that's done the same thing. It's moved the file from this folder into this other folder. So now, if we go ahead and double click on that folder to open it up, these two files that we just moved into here are now in here. So that's how you can move a file into a folder. And if you want to move a file back out of a folder, so if we wanted to move these files back out of Timmy's demo folder, back into the downloads folder, it's basically the same thing, but you have to look at the folder structure in the menu on the side of the screen. So if we look down here, you might have to scroll up or down if you have a lot of folders expanded in here, but you should find the folder you're currently in highlighted in green like this. And when we look in here, we can see we're currently in a folder called Timmy's demo folder. And that folder is inside the downloads folder. And the downloads folder is inside the main my files folder or the my files section. So if you want to drag one of these files out of the de Timmy's de demo folder back into downloads or back into my files, you can drag and drop it into any of these folders here. So it's just like moving the file into the folder, except you have to find this here and drag it here. So we'll click and drag this file and drop it in downloads. Or if we really wanted to, we could drag it back into my files or somewhere else like that. You don't have to drag it back to the exact same folder it was in before. You could drag it somewhere else if you want, but now, those files have been moved out. So, as you can see, there's no longer any files inside Timmy's demo folder. And if we go out to downloads, the coolguy.jpg is now back in downloads. And if we go further out to the my files folder, the mugshot.jpg is in my files. So now, those files have been moved back out of the folder. So, that's how you can move files in and out of folders on your Chromebook. And that'll be the most common scenario where you move files, but you can also move files to a different location using pretty much the same process. It's just a little bit more complicated. If you look at the folders on the side of the files app here, you'll see there's basically two or three sections. There's this my files section here and this section or this folder contains all of the files and folders that are stored on your Chromebook, 
So these are all the files actually on your Chromebook. And then if we go down a section here to Google Drive, these are all the files that are stored on the cloud on Google Drive in your Google account. And some of them might be synced to your Chromebook so that you can access them offline, but they're all still really Google Drive files. So they all live in this section here. And then a third section you might have is if you connected a flash drive or a external hard drive or an SD card or a micro SD card or something like that to your Chromebook, that will appear as its own third section down the bottom. So if we plug a flash drive into the Chromebook like that, after a second or two for it to process it, you'll see it pops up down here underneath Google Drive and My Files. So you have the flash drive down here and you can click on that and you can see all of the files that are on the flash drive, just like using any of the other sections. So those are really the three main sections that you might have. There is also this recent section up here, but that's not really a real section. That's just showing you all of your most recently used files across all of the other sections. So it's not really worth looking at that. But let's say you had a file in Google Drive. So we'll go over to the Google Drive section. If you had a file in Google Drive and you wanted to move it to somewhere in the My Files section or onto a flash drive or anything like that, any other combination moving from any one of these sections to another section, you can do it using basically the same method. It will just be a little bit different because you're technically copying the file, not moving it. So let's say you have this file here in Google Drive and you wanna move it into My Files. You can click and drag and drop it in My Files in that menu there just like we did before when we were dragging files in and out of folders. But because it's gone from Google Drive to your Chromebook, it's actually only copied it. So as you can see, the file is still in here in Google Drive, even though you've already dragged it to My Files. And if we click on My Files, the file is now in My Files as well. So if you're happy with that, and you want to keep one version of the file in Google Drive and another one on your Chromebook or whatever the combination is, you can keep it like that and just have two copies of the file in those two different places. But if you really did want to move the file from Google Drive to My Files and you no longer want to have it in Google Drive, all you need to do now is go back into Google Drive and find that file you moved and then just select it and click delete and click delete. And now the file will be deleted from Google Drive, but you'll still have it on your Chromebook in My Files. So if we go back over to My Files now, you'll see the file is still in here. So that's how it works. If you wanna move files between different sections on your Chromebook, it is fairly simple once you get used to it. It's just an extra step of having to copy it and then maybe delete it if you want to. So whether you wanted to move a file from one section to another or just into a different folder in the same section, that's how it's done. And now that you know how to do that, you can easily move multiple files at once if you want to. All you need to do is select all the files that you want to move by either holding down the control key and then clicking on any file you want to select like that, or clicking on the top file, holding down the shift key and then clicking on the bottom file to select a whole lot of files like that. And then it's basically the same as dragging and dropping one file, except all of them will come with it. So you can just drag and drop any of these selected files into the folder and all of the others will follow. So we can click and drag like that 
and it'll tell us we've got five files that we're basically holding right now. And then we can drop it into the folder and all of those files will move into the folder like that. So if you have quite a lot of files in one place and you want to move all of them to a different place all at once, you can do that quite quickly and easily. And that's all there is to it. That's all there is to moving files on a Chromebook. So hopefully you found this video helpful and Tamil see you in the next one.